and gentlemen, welcome back, guys. We, of course, have our TK versus Envy matchup set up. If you just joined us, we watched FaZe trounce Epsilon 3-0. Epsilon looked decent in the first half of Hardpoint Game 1. First two rounds of Search and Destroy. First five seconds before all four of them were dead on Biolab <laughs> Game 3. FaZe yeah. trounced them, man. That was not even close. Uh, no, I mean, as awful as this sounds, I don't think 11-3 was even like indicative of how that game looked. It it could have been 20 to three. It wasn't pretty. Yeah. Um, but now we got a, a new matchup here, and the TK fans out there think this is their time to shine. They they have four losses so far. They're currently three and four in the league. Uh, they're sitting on the first card. So if you're on the first card, generally that's where you you feel kind of safe in our pro league uh, standings breakdown. But maybe let's talk a little bit about those losses. Who have they come to and, and where did it all start? Week one, they had to face off against Denial and yep. against uh, that isolation squad. What, what happened in both of those cases? Uh, I mean, Denial, for the most part, I think right now is just playing a lot stronger Call of Duty than TK is. Uh, they weren't really able to keep up. I was actually surprised that went to a game five mm -hmm. uh, in week number one. And then which, uh, sorry, what was the other matchup you were speaking about? Was uh, it the, uh, the ON one? Yeah, they, they lost to ON as well that same week. Yeah, the ON, I don't believe, I don't believe I watched that series, but if I had to guess, I, I assumed it really came down to, probably, they probably went down to ON now, if I had to take a look at it. I mean, S&D for ON has been very, very strong, and they, I know when we first started, like week one and two, ON looking very, very good and hard point, but it does look like we're getting ready to load into the game. Here we go, kicking off Solar. This is game number one. And uh, this is a hard point for TK. Overall in hard point, week one, one and five. Week two, oh and two. Week three, two and four. So three wins to go with their 11 losses. Not their best game. Of. Well, this is going to test the science versus hearsay. You know, we, we heard that TK's losses coming against top teams. I think for sure in the league right now, Envy is one of those teams. They have also won since I stopped picking them. I picked Envy in this. <laughs> we'll see if TK can prove my theory. But right now, pretty back and forth. Everyone is vying for the central control here. Sharp right now on a three streak. Going to be in the hard point. Eventually going to fall. Octane, though. Great start for him. He's five and three. And Octane's been having huge games in the respawns, especially, you know, we talked about him on Parliament Uplink, what monstrous mm -hmm. games he's had. We've had J-Cap going up big when it comes to the S&Ds coming up clutch. I really like watching his Envy roster, Chris. Octane does not look comfortable with the long range SMG there. Over to Looney, who's also off to a nice start. Uh, I take that back. That was J-Cap, six and two. Let's go over to J-Cap off his next respawn. I want to see what he's doing off the break. Envy's off host this game one. It's going to be TK hosting the first hard point as well as the uplink. So if they're going to take a win, they're hoping to get it done in the first half of this series. And at the start, I definitely think they have an opportunity. You see J-Cap holding the top with the bow, but TK with the better setup. Nice kills coming in from Theory and Nameless. They're able to break this for the time being. We'll see if they can hold it. Theory's been playing great lately, uh, especially in the respawns. I guess I expect when we're talking his recent gameplay, you know you know he's going to have big plays with that sniper and the S&D. He can be a game changer with that, but I really like watching him in respawns too. Uh, he's been stepping up. And really this TK roster, when we talk about the fact that this is a team that seems to split apart and bring the same pieces back together over and over again. Yeah. But right now, for whatever reason, I get the feeling that they're really, really enjoying playing with each other uh, more than usual. Doesn't seem to be a lot of frustration going around. Great job so far by Envy for controlling these spawns. Theory rotated out, gave one of his teammates a spawn at Garage, but the other two spawn across the map. Envy just dealt with it, but just like that, you're gonna see Theory and Nezlo break in. Nezlo staying alive, Sharp holding it down with Nameless now. Great rotations coming in out of TK. I thought this was going to be a hill where Envy would just pulls away. Instead, TK holding right there with him. Brought it back to just an 11 point difference and could potentially tie it up at the end of this hill. As I say it though, you see the three man flood led by Aqua's two piece is going to clear once again. This is going back and forth, I have a feeling, all the way down to the last hard point. And Nameless, I mean, he's going to be the one that really needs to have a big game for TK. We talked about the fact that. There hasn't been a lot of slaying and respawns for TK. I mean, Nameless, the only one that's really 
really been getting it done in any capacity, some series. And when you're going up against really strong bow player, um, you know, you have someone like Octane, you have someone like Cap, he's going to have to have a monstrous series for them to take this one. But right now with 6.45 left, so far it's going to be FaZe eh, holding a relatively decent lead throughout. They have 15 point advantage right now, vying for parking lock control. A couple players here from either side. I was watching Neslo try to watch that B side, but as you can see, that's completely controlled by TK right now. And they got them spawning out so far. This should be points right now for TK. Nameless on your screen, picking up a two-piece on Aqua and JCap. They've hold it, they've held it down, and now this is the smallest margin we've seen after the first hard point. Down to just seven points. Sharp trying to make it even game as he is gonna hold on theory. In your kill feed picks up a nice two-piece. And TK doing a great job holding this top parking lot. They will go in to the next hard point with a tie score, basically. Nezla on the rotation causing some problems. You look at the mini map, they're gonna send three straight down A. Nezla's gonna try and cut through the middle, gets one, trade it out. Theory on the flank, and you're gonna see Sharp in the back there causing problems. So a great push again from Team Caliber as they clear out the first hold from Envy. And I can't remember if you mentioned this or not, but just for clarification, this is going to be TK hosting games one and three. So this is a big one. They've got to take this. They've been a they've been a pretty good S and E team, at least as of late. When I'm a casting, they've looked pretty strong. But this game one, one they're going to have to take. Now I, I don't know who's hosting for them. I know Nameless, I believe, was the ban, so he won't be able to pick it up. We've seen him have some huge games on host. That's going to be a big part of that. But watching JCap and crew. Try to break this. They're trailing by 10 right now. 15 seconds left until we enter our second side of rotations here, Chris. TK trying to pull away. Final eight seconds. They'll milk every single one. Guys, we got a question for you in the chat. Which player will have the most kills in map number one currently? You got 20 kills from Nameless. Everyone else on TK with 18 on the other side. Aqua only one above 18 at 21 kills. Adds his 22nd there. Octane picking up a couple here on this A Street. Catches another one by Ring. He's going to get two. Checks window there trying to challenge his Octane. He's got three to deal with here mid-map. Not a lot of points coming in for either team right now, but it's Octane really getting worked on. He was set up around glass, able to pick up three kills before he was going to drop. Oh, look at that vote. It just popped up right on my screen. Oh, yeah. Loving the, loving the new features here on MLG.TV. I, I got to pick somebody, though. I yeah, which, which player from TK are you going with? Oh, well, you know, I'm, I'm nameless. going nameless. I went nameless too. He's in the lead right now. He'll, he can't <laughs> let us down, right? Exactly. That was my reasoning. Oh, he's in the lead now. <laughs> right now, immediately, he's in the lead. <laughs> All right, so here we are in the central hardpoint, getting ready to rotate over to the B-bomb site. Sharp loses a gunfight, though, and Octane gets a three-piece, so this should be some time yeah. here for Envy early on. Cap's able to get one. One pushing from second story. Gets some shots in on Nameless before he's going to dip for control. And he's just getting pushed from every side, blinded up by the sun. Not able to pick up anymore before he falls. But it's Octane that's on a four streak right now. You saw him get the three piece in transition to hard point number two. And he tries to push in for a drop kick before getting taken out. This is pretty ridiculous stuff you're seeing right now. From the NB lineup, everything was going in TK's favor. Octane turns up, then Looney. Just clears out that hard point. Down goes Aqua though. So now you stop scoring points. Octane has to jump in. JCap's gonna fall. Good push here from Theory as he gets the two piece. Sharp trying to back him up with some nades to middle. They'll get the final 10 seconds it looks like. But the fight about to begin for garage control. Sharp losing the first battle and this is terrible if you're TK trying to spawn up. You can see all the way across the map from the new HP. They're gonna have their work cut out for him trying to break. Yeah, they had a couple players watching the cross, too. It made map, but Nameless able to win one gun fight. Nezzle will be the first man in. He catches one peeking outside of window, then turns and almost takes out Octane as well. Nezzle wins that one. That would have been ridiculous, but Sharp is there to clean it up. But they haven't even really been able to push in to get any pressure on the hard point until now. First man in was Theory. He gets taken out. The entire team of Envy stepping up with kills across the board right now. And just like that, we'll have a lead change in a matter of seconds. Lead going to Envy. First we've seen in a while. Three players on streaks right now for them. Doing a great job here of holding garage. Going over to JCap. He stepped up as kind of their vocal leader for this squad. The veteran going to the World Championship in 2013. Black Ops 2 fell just short to Impact, but was able to get his World Championship with Denial this year in AW. 
jcap has been around forever and right now he is showing you why plus eight on a five streak has helped take the lead back for envious and now we'll find out can they stop tk from doing what they did in the first rotation that's hold this top parking lot you see a big kill coming out of aqua to jcap's left jcap's gonna come surging up from this b street and a nice second kill following looney so Good clear here from Envy, and they did it on their first attempt. Now you got J-Cap, 7th Street and down 8th Street. Everything looking great for the boys in blue. Yeah, this is great. If you are Envy, getting this kind of performance out of J-Cap, 8th Street right now, we'll see if it can continue. He's trying to get his health back. Peaks for a second with that sub before he's going to fall. Sharp then gets oh. a three-piece. Big for TK. Nameless gets the last, and this should be a lead, cha lead change here. I'd be surprised if we see... Well, I guess, no, they have enough time to push here. They're going to do it one more time. They had 20 seconds left. They decided to give it one more go. TK still getting the scrap time as it stands, but they're able to apply enough pressure there. Do they break it for the final couple of seconds? They will. So they disrupted probably about 10 points or so for TK, enough to not let them get the lead here going into this hard point. Sharp did all the damage at the top there. This game would have been out of hand already, but Sharp went on a six streak to finish out that top hard point. A huge three piece, cleared the hill and got TK back in the game. Now you see just five points separating these squads. TK could retake the lead. Three straight kills in your feed, all blue. Neslo still inside scoring points. Sharp and Nameless trying to keep them alive, but they know the push is coming flooding through the back. Big kills from both players. Neslo has to defend himself though as they both drop and there he does oh, with that he just won the game. Piece. TK's got this locked up and they can hold on for five more seconds. I think Neslo won the game there with that two-piece. I don't know how he killed that player, Cat, but giant plays from him. They're able to break in, but it's too little, too late. Game number one, going to be going to TK. See? Scientific facts. When Navy doesn't pick TK, they step it up and win games. Granted, they're hosting game number one, <laughs> but I think this is a team that can take the S&D. If they go up 2-0 against Envy, I don't know if I see this Envy roster battling back to down on two, Chris. Uh, I have great news. Neither of us got our prediction correct. Theory drops most kills on Team Caliber, dropping 37 and 38. So many engagements, 10 captures from Theory as he drops 6,700 points. The highest score in the game, though, is going to go to Aqua. He led everyone in terms of kills. You see, let's look at the stats one more time. Aqua. A couple of captures. A couple of captures. 36 and 37. Sorry, it was the captures that separated him. JCap, 39 and 27. He was about even going into the last four minutes. Turned up, but it wasn't enough. TK with the break at the top and the finish down low gives Envy their first loss here in the best of five. Coming up next, though, we got Search and Destroy. Plenty more games. Does Envy tie it up, Maven? I'm, I'm, I'm taking TK in this one. TK is going to lose. Maven no, shared for him. TK is going to lose. Well, big. He's going to win two different 1v2s. Yeah, put the mullets in the chat. We'll be right back. <laughs> Sharp Army.